They said great, pave the way, chase the rain, release the pain, leash you sane, getting paid, trend set it brighter days, dope a rat, tight as set, high and deadly, I'm a fighter jet, Jeremy K. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back. AB is looking like he's a serial killer. This guy's looking like it's raining men. Hallelujah, it's raining men. I don't know what's going on with this guy. I'm the super diva Quincy Elliott. <laughs> but now I know this is a sensitive topic for Muffins because he hates Ring of Honor or he thinks Ring of Honor is absolutely dead. That it's been buried. Ring of, Ring of Honor went out of business December 31st, 2021. As of right now, Chris Jericho, who has won a belt in every promotion. Look at that. Jericho, eight-time major title champ. Now, let me say something. Oh, wow. This is going this way. I already... You know what? Go ahead because I can't say nothing about Chris Jericho because it's going to get absolutely missled out here. You know what? Before we start, before we start hammering on Jericho, make sure to follow us on Twitter and Instagram at the Urban Rest Network. Look below; it's scrolling across. We'll throw it up there uh, a little bit later, uh, just where that Jericho eight time thing is. Uh, make sure that you subscribe, like talk to us do comments it doesn't matter talk to us on twitter we're we're always on freaking twitter um my twitter i'm not sure why it's not showing it but i'll see in a second uh my twitter is a beans the old man's over there frozen um anyways so i'll get into it since i'm really talking like always um Eight time, eight time. now he gets to do an eight they throw two four two fours Two fours. He'll throw the two fours up, you know. And he, his that that photo that they had of him last night. I'm going to go on Twitter in a second and see if I can find it. But that photo they had of him, it just looks so old man holding up that silver title that means nothing right now. Maybe it'll mean something in the future, but it means nothing right now. And then taking it off of uh, Cesaro. Cesaro I, I don't know why they would do, have done that. I mean, the, the title didn't mean anything. And just handing it off from person to person every few weeks, it, it, it didn't mean anything. I did like the show. I will say that. that was a good, it was a good show. It was a good match. Uh, Cesaro had to sell like five or six times. Uh, Jericho is getting a little bit slow in the ring. Let's be honest. The dude's, you know, 50. I know I couldn't go in the ring um, for that long. But why put it on him? It doesn't make any sense. You know, because are they going to try? Value. So was Cesaro. That's why they brought well, him from WWE, right? Uh, but so if, if you're trying to work a TV deal, and please give me a second because I know you're going to go nuts. If you're trying to work a TV deal, who are you going to say? Um, we got Chris Jericho, the Ring of Honor champion, or Cesaro, the Ring of Honor champion. Chris Jericho's name is going to hit harder. Yeah, it is. It is. Uh, yeah, I mean, you know, he's he's uh, the 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 name value for Fozzie and whatever else he does, and you know. But I, I don't know. I did give 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 time and give room to these young guys. They've got tons of young guys. They've got tons of other WWE retreads that they could have put it on. Why why put it on him? Are they just going to try to recreate what they did? With putting it on, uh, putting the 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 AEW championship on the first time, it, it doesn't. It I don't I don't see it making sense. But it was. It was I thought it was a smart move. Okay, uh, once again, the oldest man of the group is going to come here to make sense of it all. You got to speak up. You're coming in low. Oh, I was going to say, you know, that I'm here to make sense of everything. You know. That the guys just mentioned, we already know beans is slow even going to the kitchen to make a bag of popcorn late at night. So we already know that. And the reason Chris Jericho won the belt was because what Chef said. He's in name value. They're trying to get that TV deal for the Ring of Honor, which is never going to happen. So Chris Jericho is the name that will get attachment to the belt. 
we know the company's already been went under back in December 31st, 2021. They're still trying to hold on to something that's not there, which I don't know why. Let Ring of Honor die, let us just die. Put some dirt on it, put a little like, yellow, yellow rose, put some water, and let it go. This makes no sense why Jericho needs to win this belt, but like Chef said, he's the name, and that's the only reason why he won the belt. No other reason why. I mean, he doesn't need to win the, uh, an eighth different belt in 27 different companies that's wrestled in the last 25 years. Does it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It just it has no name value. And Claudio Castellelli was a good champion, and he should have stayed the champion for as long as he, he they could have kept it on him and built it on him. But unfortunately, that's not how professional wrestling works nowadays. You have to have that name value attached to something if you want to sell it to something or somewhere to get a TV deal. So you got to put stuff on John Moxley, Brian Danielson, Chris Jericho, whoever the big guys are. That's how you have to pay, put the bills on there and sell it. Now, can I ask you guys before, because I know you guys really can care less about this. He won the, the WCW heavyweight title, right? Yep. Okay. He won the WWE, whichever title was at the time, right? The heavyweight title. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the big one. He won the belt. AEW heavyweight title. Yep. Now he's the Ring of Honor heavyweight champion. He's won yep. the top prize in every promotion he's been in. Okay. But, but why does he have to be the win the Ring of Honor when he's 50? That makes no sense whatsoever unless, like you said, they're trying to attach a name to the belt to go after a TV deal. That's the only that's there. There's no other reason for him to win this type of belt at 50 years old. No reason whatsoever, except for that. I mean, it's Jericho. I mean, obviously, it is what it is. I, AB, you got anything left on this? No, nah, not really. I, I, I just, I, I can't see why they, they would have done it. Um, you know, I know Jericho's a name. I know that he's got some value. I know that they're trying to put some, you know, some of their shows or their shows back on uh, on TV somehow, some way. But I, I don't know. They're, they 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 have way too many wrestlers. We've talked about it before. They have a lot of talent. They've ha- they they push they push retreads. They they push people out the door that shouldn't be out the door. I mean, put it on Sammy. Put it on Guevara. What? Yeah, put it on Guevara. Right now, the dude's the biggest freaking heel in, in AEW besides MJF, which you don't put anything on, on MJF that isn't the the big daddy title. Um, and, and even then, that dude is a dude that you just, he doesn't need a title. He really, really doesn't need a, a title to be, um, who who he is, but a- anyways, getting back to the the ROH one, I- I'm tired of seeing those titles getting defended on on Rampage. I want to see them on their own show. I'm tired of that belt getting passed around. Um, yeah, I, I'm I I can't really say too much on it. Yeah, Good show. two two champions, two champions since they brought that company back in April. When was the last time you seen the Ring of Honor six man title being defended since the, since Dalton and the boys won it at the last pay per view show? Where's Mercedes Martinez, the Ring of Honor women's title champion? She she's defended against Serena D. Exactly. They keep holding on to something that's dead, and you don't have any time to show what the, those are. And bells and whatever talent is still left. So you take a month here and you, and you show the heavyweight title, and then you take another month and then you you showing the TV title, but you're forgetting about the women's champion. You're forgetting about the six men champion, but you don't have time for that. But you have time for Chris Jericho, you know, winning the belt on a Friday night. But you have you have two other shows on Ring of Honor. I'm sorry, on AEW on on YouTube. Take one of those those shows and make it into Ring of Honor show. 
and okay. tape it so that we do on Wednesdays, on Fridays, start the show early. So let's start at yeah. seven instead of nine. You know, then we do an show. hour. Good. Do it precisely. You do two hours before nine. You have two hour shows right there for the next two weeks. Of Ring of Honor. Uh, we talk all we need to talk. This guy definitely looks worse than I thought. Jesus. Shit, AB. You didn't post that. Wow. I didn't even see that picture. <laughs> really, really. Hey, hey, we got to give credit to uh, AEW for that photo because they did post it. And then uh, I'm sharing uh, fiending, f- fiending for Flowers on Twitter. Fiend for Follows. Oh, Followers. Fiending for followers. Uh, no. You know, Thanks. Um, Thanks. salute to them for capturing that madness. But if anybody's ever seen the show Breaking Bad, he looks like he's a meth head from on that show. Um, he looks rough. Damn, A.B. Better call Saul. <laughs> Better call Saul. Where's Saul? <laughs> Saul. Uncle Saul. Saul, where are you? So I think we Saul. talked that we got one more topic. We'll be in and out of that one. For myself, these two crazies, old ass Jericho, we're out of here. Deuces. They said great, paved the way, chase the rain, release the pain, lease you sane, getting paid, trend set it, brighter day, dope a rap, tight as set it, high in Delhi, I'm a brighter